recommend a book that I'd like you to read. You know, I'm not a, a book reader. I've read, uh, since I graduated high school many years ago, maybe half a dozen books. I, I gather, gather my information in, in bits and pieces off the internet or from magazines or newspaper articles and things, but I very seldom sit down and read a book. But I got one now that I want to recommend to you because it's very important to, uh, to all gun owners and, and really anybody that cares about our government and our Constitution. This book is called Guns Across the Border. It was written by a friend of mine, Mike Deddy. That's the reason I agreed to even read the thing. Uh, I knew Mike knew what he was talking about. Now, you know, we've all heard of the uh, Fast and Furious program because we had a Border Patrol agent that got killed because of ATF's direct involvement letting guns go across the border into Mexico. Now, I always thought that this was a... Uh, program started by the Obama administration, but it predated the Obama administration. Uh, before Fast and Furious, uh, another part of the Project Gun Runner program was called Operation Wide Receiver. And in that, Mike Deddy, the author of this book, was directly involved in it. He was the, uh, the key gun dealer that the ATF used to let guns walk across the border to the Mexican drug cartels. Now, <clears throat> the reason they did this was so they could say that uh, U.S. guns was going into Mexico and we had to stop the flow. So they was doing it to try to ban us from having semi-automatic weapons in the United States. And then what the government proposed to Mike, they said that the guns would be tracked in Mexico and that all this stuff would be taken care of. And he did it. He thought he was doing, uh, as a patriotic citizen, doing a good job to help our government. Turns out that they stuck him in the back. They betrayed him. They uh, threw him under the bus. And if he hadn't kept good notes on this stuff, and he did, he kept notes, he kept uh, voice recordings between him and the uh, gun runners and him and the ATF. If he hadn't kept those things, I think the government would have killed him by now. But uh, he's got the book out, so the word is out, and I highly recommend you get this book and read it, Guns Across the Border by Mike Daddy. It's available on Amazon.com. You can get it for your Kindle if you got one of those things. Uh, right now, it's less than 20 bucks on Amazon.com. And I highly recommend that you get this book and you read it and you can see what the things that our government does. You know, I don't know how high up the chain it went, but we had some uh, uh, government officials uh, in the agency, which would be ATFE. I always call them ATF because for years it was just referred to as alcohol, tobacco, and farms. But they set this operation up. They let hundreds or thousands of guns illegally go to Mexico so that they could... Uh, take away our constitutional rights to own and use firearms. Anyway, get the book, read it, I highly recommend it, and I think you'll learn a lot from it. It's available on Amazon.com, Guns Across the Border by Mike Daddy.